set of laws will be taking effect at the start of the new year. Our Timber Schumann spoke with the Colorado State Patrol, the Department of Agriculture, and a local farmer to find out more about how these laws will affect them and us. You can't hold your cell phone and drive at the same time. Governor Polis approved Senate Bill 24065 June 5th of 2024. Colorado State Patrol Trooper Sherry Mendez tells me on January 1st this new law will crack down on distracted driving. Well this one you can't be on your cell phone at all. You cannot have it in your hand. She says phone mounts on the windshield or dashboard are still allowed. Otherwise folks should use Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. If you do break the law. First time offender is fined $75 and they're giving two driver's license suspension points. Mendez tells me fines will increase for recurring offenders. Another vehicle related law, House Bill 241055, also takes effect January 1st. The bill increases the age at which children are required to use a child restraint system from under 8 years of age to under 9 years of age. It also means kids 2 years old and 40 pounds and under must be restrained in a rear-facing car seat. The cage free law was adopted in 2020. House Bill 2013-43 has two phases, the first of which went into effect January of 2023. Colorado Department of Agriculture's Dan Zingari tells me the next phase goes into effect this January. There's the final phase moving to a fully cage-free facility for all egg-laying hens for eggs that are going to be sold and distributed in Colorado. He says this will only apply to farms with 3,000 or more birds. So there should not be much disruption in the supply chain. We started the farm in 2015. I, I am happy to see that um, for the um, health of the birds, to be honest. Owner of Green Junction Farmstead, Don Adams, is happy to see the step in the right direction, though she says cage-free and free range are two very different things. So it's a little deceiving cage-free because they're just not in a cage. It doesn't mean that they get a lot of space to roam. Adam suspects the prices for eggs will rise a little since the major producers might have to invest in some new infrastructure to meet these new guidelines. However, in her eyes, this could be an incentive for residents to shop local. Anything that you can get closer to home, local, from uh, the farmers here in the valley is always best. It's always going to be fresher. Several more laws will take effect on the 1st. If you want to find out more information, they're available on the Colorado General Assembly's website. Tim Schumann, CARE-X. Trooper Mendez did tell us if you receive a first-time ticket for using your phone while driving, that ticket can be waived upon proof of purchasing a window mount or some sort of hands-free device. Well, a record